few years ago, I made a speaker for my phone. Now, I've changed my phone a few times since then. And I've done a lot of projects since, so I thought I'd revisit it, but do something completely different. So from my wood pile, I've picked a bit of sapili. This bit's pretty rough, so first job is to plane it on two sides. So I've got a couple of surfaces square on this. Now I need to rip some strips to the thickness of my phone, including the case. So I'm just gonna get the fence set up and make some rips. These boards are a little rough off the band saw, so I'm just gonna run them through the thicknesser and clean them up. Now, I wanna cut these boards into squares. So what I'm gonna do is use the width of the board to set a stop on the miter gauge, and then I can cut some pits. Now I've got a pile of squares and to go with it, I've got a pile of drill bits and I wanna drill a series of ever increasing holes. So the first job is to mark out the center of all of these squares. Now I just need to get these five holes drilled. So I'm gonna start with the biggest and work my way down until they're all done. They're all cut, but now I need a way from the sound to get from the bottom of the phone to those holes. So what I need to do is mark out where the position of the phone will go on the smallest hole, mark out a little ledge for the phone, and then join the bottom of the ledge up to the hole. I'm gonna use the bandsaw now to get this shape cut out. The surfaces of these pieces are nice and smooth. Where I've planed them, but where I've drilled the holes and where I've made those bandsaw cuts, they just need a little bit of hand sanding. So time for the glue up. I'm actually gonna start at the back. I'm gonna start with a solid panel. So this will keep the phone in place. In fact, I'm gonna go for two solid panels just to make this a bit more stable. Then can be the bit that holds the phone and then just keep layering up the ever increasing circles. Now, I can just get it all clamped up and then I'm gonna have to take it into the house where it's warm to dry. And then tomorrow, we'll do some sanding. Right, glue's dried on this now. Let's get the clamps off and then everyone's favorite job, sanding. I'm 
I'm done sanding it, but it is quite literally freezing out here. So I'm going to go inside to get some finish applied. Before I apply any finish to this, I'm just going to do something I always forget to do, and that's add my brand to it. For finish, I'm going to go with some mineral oil, so I'm just going to get that brushed on and leave it to dry. So the finish is dry and that's it all done. Now I've just got to find something good to listen to. Hello Keith, for those listening you won't be able to see this but Keith has snowmen on his jumpers and a Santa hat on and I don't know if you can see mine. So I think you can definitely tell a difference with the volume is significantly louder so it's worked pretty well. And that's it all done. So thanks for watching, thanks to my patrons and please subscribe for more videos. Thank mm -hmm. you.